Young over here again to give you the latest in the entertainment world. So, the BET Awards here it's Sunday, June 26th, and boy, was it full of excitement. From Queen B and Kendrick Lamar's grandstanding opener to Jesse Williams' freedom speech, let's talk about the person who stole the show. And I'm not talking about you, Miss Beyonce. Although, as my personal favorite, you slayed all day. Yes. <laughs> Jesse Williams' speech was a showstopper this weekend as the Grey's Anatomy actor, model, and activist touched on black lives, equal rights, and freedom as he received the BET Humanitarian Award. Now this is also in particular for the black women, in particular, who have spent their lifetimes dedicated to nurturing everyone before themselves. We can and will do better for you. The actor also gave an ultimatum moving forward as he lamented further on why black lives matter. Justin Timberlake, however, suffered a backlash as some fans misinterpreted his tweet. He even had to apologize, for God's sake. <laughs> now back to the motherland. So, Nigerian comic rapper and actor Falarin Falana, aka Fouls the Bad Guy, took home the Viewer's Choice Best International Act Award. I don't know the carry last, so I keep telling you guys. <laughs> and by the way, did you know that Falls is the son of the highly respected lawyer and activist Femi Falana? Neither did I. Neither did I. Oh. South African DJ Black Coffee with Whiskey Yemi Alade, aka Casper Nile Best, Diamond Platinums, Miss V, and Serge Bernard for the Best International Act Africa Award, making him the first South African artist to have received an award in that category. He's currently working on a new collaboration with American artist Alicia Keys. Her husband, Swiss Beat, posted a video on Instagram praising his recent project, Pieces of Me, to show his support. This new Black Coffee album is crazy. Last but not the least, Nigerian artist Lalu Shembajo, whose art is displayed on Beyonce's Lemonade video, was also there for the BET experience. Both BET International and the Grammy Museum are partnering to showcase Lalu's art now through fall 2016, so make your way over there. <laughs> the only thing better than winning a Grammy is having your art in their museum, he shared on Instagram. So tell me, what was your highlight of the BET Awards this year? Comment below and don't forget to click like and subscribe at the end of this video. Cheers! Growing up in Kenya, my sister and I were very close. But like any sisters, we fought a lot. She always got new clothes and I always got hand-me-downs. Now she's putting her children through school in Kenya. We still fight sometimes, especially when I send money for the kids. I tell her, buy some clothes for the younger one and we both laugh. With nearly 500,000 locations, our app and online, this is moving money for better.